contraption is a tapenator and it shows how the hearing flows. This is the outer, the outer ear. Oh, the, the sound goes through the ear, into the auditory canal, into the ear. And then proceeds to the middle ear, goes through the malleus, then through the incus and stapes, known as the hammer, anvil, and stirrup. Then it's the oval window, followed by the inner ear, or it's basically just the cochlea, and through the hair cells to the brain. And then it rings the bell. <laughs> okay. So our, our contraption is the eye, and when the eye or the light hits, well, goes through the eye, goes to the cornea, the iris, and the pupil. Um, it hits a suspensory ligament, which is, um, focuses the lens, and which is connected to the ciliary muscle. Go for it. Hey, when it goes through the lens, it goes through the vitreous chamber, and the rods and cones in your eyes pick up on the light, and they send it through your retina, and then through your optic nerve. When it reaches the optic chasmin, the light switches around so that you see the way the world is. It goes through the optic tracts. From the optic tracts, it hits your brain, and the occipital lobe is where your brain picks it up, and you see. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> machine is called the blind side and it represents how light goes through the eye and comes out and represents sight and our blind side. Well, it starts here, it goes to the cornea, to the pupil, iris, the lens, the optic nerve. And it goes here to the curious chamber, which is covered by the slurry. And this other one is like this one is a blind spot which you can't see because it has many cones or the rods. <laughs> shows how sound goes to the brain. It starts with the extraordinary artery, uh, artery canal to the eardrum. And it goes to the incas, not to the malice, and then the incas and the stapes. And then it goes through the oval window, the scala vestibuli, uh, the scala tympani, and then the round window. And then it goes to the basilar membrane, then the Membrane, and then the nerve fibers, and then finally to the brain. And this is how it works. Oh! <laughs> Hi, this is our group, Donna, Sarah, and Gabby, and it's called I spy. Well, um, this project shows how the eye works backwards. Um, it, it's part, it takes part of the, in the occipital part of the brain, occipital lobe, and it goes to the optic nerve, optic disc, which is the blind spot, the retinal veins and arteries, and vitreous chamber, lens, pupil, iris, aqueous humor, cornea, and then the light and the picture comes out.
Did you get Well, this is our model, and it's called the eavesdropper. And a quick fact about the ear, it's that besides having receptors for sound waves, it also has receptors for equilibrium. So, and it starts out in the external ear, and goes down the malus and the incus and the Goes, then it goes from the external ear to the inner ear, goes to the oval window, and then through cochlea, the vestibular branch, and then... The bathroom membrane, the hair cell, tutorial membrane, and the membrane. And this is how it works.